All right, we're here tonight to check out some fine shaving cream. So if you haven't checked out our site recently, I encourage you to have a look at Fine. We have two new creams by them, and they are in two of the more popular scents from the Fine line, American Blend and Platinum. So I'm gonna check out American Blend tonight. It's kind of a herbaceous uh, scent. It's got some basil. It's got some oak moss, some chili, I wanna say. Maybe, at least two out of three, I suppose. Uh, I've used this just a handful of times now. Uh, it is relatively new to market. I am a fan of Fine's work, and I love their packaging. They really nail it every time. And this new format, I wanna give it a go, see how it works. Some of you may be interested in using creams, may prefer creams to soaps, period. Others may really like fine products and scents, but want an easier to travel or easier to lather format. Creams might be a good way to go. Uh, these are 3.3 ounces, so maybe not good for check uh, in airport, or for um, on the plane carry on, plane in airports, but certainly would be fine for checking. Uh, and I'm gonna show you a couple different ways to lather it. We'll have a go, I've got my Perea bowl here. As you can see, it's got quite a lot of ridges, grooves, and all sorts of knobs and other great stuff in here. Uh, I'm going to give this a bit of a dollop. Let's try, let's go with that. Okay, that's what it looks like in this enormous bowl. I'm also going to be using tonight, because I just really like using it now that I have it, this West Coast Infinity brush, 26 millimeter. This is the synthetic, not option. Um, let's give it a go. Some people do like to always work out of a bowl. I am not one of those people. I prefer face lathering. But there are times when I want to lather out of a bowl, at least I should say start lathering out of a bowl, and then work into a face lather. There are other times where, but rare, where I do the entire lather build in the bowl. Tonight what I'm trying to do is build enough of a uh, pasty foundation in the knot so that I can then work into a face lather. You certainly don't need to do it that way. I just prefer face lathering. All right, pasty, right? I mean, very pasty. Here we go, my face is a tiny bit wet. concentrate on one half of the face for now. I've been having fun with this brush recently. Got it on hand uh, about, what is it, three days ago or so? And uh, it's gonna be posting, not this exact model, but one's just like it'll be posting on the website any day uh, around the time this video posts as well. And yeah, I've been having quite a lot of fun with it. Great for face lathering because it's, the knot is set quite deeply, but it still has plenty of splay as you can see. All right. Let me tell you what I'm looking for as I'm dialing in this fine cream. It looks like it is very near good to go. And you could, you could go right from here. I choose not to. I like to go a little bit further with the water content. And the way that I know I like to go a little further is within seconds of applying it and looking at the light, it's starting to get dull. And ever since I watched The Shining, I know that it is not good to be dull. All I'm doing is working in a couple of drops more water and trying to make sure that it's really well mixed because I think that when I get lather that looks good but then dulls quickly, that the water just might must not be mixed thoroughly enough throughout. And so all I'm doing here is trying to make sure that I introduce a bit more water a bit more evenly. 
there we go. So this is plenty good, plenty good for shaving. Uh, and you could test here, you could see the slickness here. So for example, I ran my finger down and this still has lots of slickness. I mean, it's like an ice skating pond, uh, lots of slickness to go. Uh, great residual slickness, great primary slickness. As you'll see here, when I pull out the lather, excellent density, cushion, uh, <laughs> right? It didn't take a lot of work to generate that kind of lather at all. Uh, and that is partly because this is a good product and partly because spending that little extra time with the lather can really make a huge difference in the quality of your shave. So check it out, right? Add water, do it slowly. Nothing's gonna happen, I promise. If it starts to get a little too washed out for you, add a tiny bit more soap or cream. But by and large, even just working a lather that is overhydrated a bit more, it's gonna be fine so long as you don't add the water too quickly. And that's, you know, at times when I mess up, that's what I did. Um, as long as you add that water slowly, no problem. Okay, so we have plenty in here uh, to load the brush. Again, we're not gonna do that right now. Instead, I want to go to the other side and just revisit something that you may have seen in one of our other shave videos applying the cream directly to your face against the grain. Uh, let's say you don't have a bowl, or don't want a bowl, or don't need a bowl. Uh, you're traveling, you could throw a tiny bit of cream from that larger tube into a small baggie. All right, and you're applying it against the grain. All right, so I know how my hair tends to grow, and so I'm going in the opposite direction. And you could see here the lines uh, in the lather on my fingers to know that it was hitting hairs growing against that. All right, what we're gonna do is take the wet brush. It's got a tiny bit of lather still in it, but nothing major. Certainly nothing that would be sufficient to shave with. So it's essentially starting over. I'm trying to work the coverage again, just like the other side. Okay, so plenty of coverage here. I'm looking in the mirror. It's starting to get a tiny bit dull, just a little bit. So one more round of water. Doing my best to mix it up. Get everything to the right level. We're good to go. That's it, that's all it takes. We'll see the lather we got on this side. Didn't take really any time at all. Mm -hmm. Well, not nearly as much lather left in the brush after that pass, but uh, again, right, you can see plenty of lather there, fewer shaving. That slickness, that glide, it's all there. It's gonna be a great shave. All right, thanks for joining. Check out these fine creams if you're interested. Again, great if you like the scents, great if you're trying something new. Uh, very easy to work with the creams. Loading, slightly different. The lathering, just the same. Have a good night, all. See you soon.